Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hopefully, you guys are having an awesome day filled with positive vibes. Today, we got a great video for you guys. We are dropping a early access video to the Gunsmith Season, aka Season 9. Currently, it is available in Garena, so you already know we had to hop on and show you guys what is new. So, what we're going to be doing right now, as you guys will see in a few seconds, we are going to be on the arena version and we're going to run through everything as well as give you guys a quick sneak peek of how the killer bolt action could run so you guys make sure to go ahead and watch till the end of the video so you guys can watch the entire thing so as you guys see we were holding i am actually on anna karen's account but low key a huge shout out to her for letting me use her account so that i can actually try it out but you guys will see using the kilo bolt action with this character which hopefully we can actually check out the stats but i don't think we can but just to keep that in mind we will probably be getting this update later today if not we're gonna have it on saturday night but the season will only start for us in na on saturday night at 8 p.m so make sure to stay tuned for that but anyway guys the main thing that you can see is brand new screen as well as basically a new hud very similar to the one that we saw on the test server you can see if you go to multiplayer there's a brand new scene so also um i don't know if there's any private games or anything like that available but you can actually play a bunch of you know gunfights hardpoint free for all and there is no new maps yet because those will be coming out on the 14th on paper so we'll see how that goes while we're on arena now we're gonna check out some of the cool things that you can see right off the get-go and it's gonna be mostly all stuff in loadouts the main thing you can see there is currently 10 loadouts i'm actually gonna turn off the audio on that because it's kind of loud i'm not gonna lie to you guys that background music it's kind of loud so i just wanted to, you guys to hear it just a little bit it's actually really nice i really like it but when talking i don't want to have too much background audio so we're gonna actually make this all muted i lied we're not gonna do that we're gonna turn off the music so that we can talk and just hear each other out so the first thing we're gonna check out is the loadouts so if you go to multiplayer you get 10 loadouts and you have access to gunsmithing there's a few new things you need to know the Molotov, which is absolutely overpowered right now is available it is actually deals more damage and it's no longer a score streak we actually have also new score streaks as well as a few buffs and nerfs on each of these as well as a change of name on the katana into the shadow blade those are just you know stuff that we can see when the patch note comes out we'll talk about that more in depth but i want to show you guys some of the cooler stuff that's available and it is literally the skins and how they make it so for example if you want the urban tracker you can go ahead and click on her and customize or equip ghost same thing however ghosts will have multiple skin attached and rather than have to go one at a time you actually have them all attached so for example ghost bang this is going to be the character i have boom david mason kruger but not only that as we go further and further you will see some cool new characters that you've probably never seen before like Revnov, archangel what an insane skin you know american bulldog these are all characters dark shepherd look at these insane new skins they're gonna be coming out very soon vivian harris look at that small hitbox carver butcher look at all these cool ones this one is not a new one unfortunately but there's one that I will be rocking, and I call this because it literally looks like me. I'm not even joking when I say it. Ak Takeo, Takio, bro, if that's not a skin meant for me, I don't know what is, chat. Look at this. Boy, does that not look exactly like me, chat? Holy smoke. Look, 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 look. Ready? Bro, is it not me? That's, that's me. One more time. Bro, is it not me? I literally have the same thing. Literally. I know Bobby says that, but I am actually no cap same exact skin as this guy bro literally have the same so i'm gonna be rocking that skin just gonna put it out there and also have you guys seen this guy witch warden i want to talk about small hitboxes he actually has holes in his body so there is that he actually has holes in his body so hitboxes is gonna be pretty insane this is what you're gonna get from the master 2 great br grind there's actually none of the rewards or any of the battle passes currently so we're not going to be able to check them and then there's a whole bunch of these other ones that we can go through if we want to but nothing is going to be something that you haven't seen before that's just really the main one i really wanted to show you guys now another cool thing if you go ahead gunsmith is available i decided to level up this one unfortunately it didn't go as planned so whenever the gunsmith comes out we'll be going through every single well, not every one of them but most of the uh, shotgun one but this is the important one the kilo boat action which is something that just got added into the game it's got pretty good stats as you guys will see right now 
I have it already level 12 because you can actually use it in VR. So I'm actually going to show you guys the footage of the of the killer boat in like a few seconds after I finish talking and then afterwards you guys will enjoy. So you guys see it has pretty insane range. So if we can compare the snipers, you can kind of compare what it does. So if we compare it to the Arctic, Arctic has 83 damage, 862 accuracy and 90 range. This one has 81 damage, 70 accuracy and 86 range. So it's a little more, it's, it's a little worse than the Arctic, right? It's a little worse than the Arctic when it comes to range. But the damage is about the same, a little less, and accuracy a little bit better. Fire rate, it's going to be, I believe, a little bit slower as well. Yeah, fire rate's a little bit slower. This fire rate is 31, 42, 68. We have 28, 49, 70. So the mobility is really good, though. 49 mobility is pretty good compared to, like, the Arctic, the DLQ, the Locust, and not the Outlaw, though. Actually, the best comparison would be the Outlaw, which has 80 damage, 68 accuracy, and... 85 range so already in that sense it's losing out except for maybe the accuracy as you guys can see the accuracy currently a little bit lower yeah a little bit higher but the range as you, it's kind of hard to compare like that 83 68 83 yeah and the fire rate on the uh, outlaw is probably going to be a little bit slower so 68 53 41 but look at this control insane so i'm actually excited to try that uh, we don't actually know all the attachments available but those are the main thing available, nothing new in events. We're actually gonna check it out, but wanted to show you guys some early Kilo Sniper action. It's actually really insane, some of the attachment that we discovered. I'm not gonna spoil anything for you guys, but I'm actually gonna be using it as a shotgun and it's gonna be super insane. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the rest of the video. If you did, I'll see you guys at the end. Oh, oh, I seen it, I seen it. Oh, let's go, no perks, but let's go. All right, let's try this gun. Two tap on armor, that's not bad. Does this guy have a kill? He does. Okay, he has a better one. Let's see what attachment I have. I have lightweight, convenient for moving ADS. We have high power laser sight. Okay. Oh, it has stopping power? Kill a bolt action, stopping power? Yo, it has stopping power. It has stopping power. That boy got one tap. That boy got one tap. Yeah, it's either two or one tap. I think depending on the armor. I'll try one more time. Oh, I found it. Let's go. I missed the second shot. Yeah, it's a two shot. So it, with armor, it's a two shot, so. Headshot. Headshot will kill it one shot, so that's good. Even through the armor. Level two armor, I believe. Yeah. Are they inside? Two tap, that's pretty good. See, those are bot names. How am I using this gun in Garena? It's uh, available in VR. I think I was a, a bot still. At range, it's not gonna kill, I don't think. Nice. It's a two tap. That was a one tap because he was probably super low. Chip terminal is almost ready. Guys, scan me. Chinese name. Love to see it. What if they're in the water? Oh, I see one. Only two teams left. Getting close to victory. See, it's kind of. It just feels so good to quick scope with this. It feels really good. Can you just like. I'm actually curious. Obviously the spread is pretty insane, but that was a uh, pretty nice, not gonna lie. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, share, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about the brand new update. It's gonna probably come very soon, but let me know what you guys think, as well as the killer boat action sniper. I don't know what we want to call it, but the marksman sniper. Anyway, I'm super excited about it. The way I'm gonna build it, it's gonna be very similar to a shotgun build where it's quick ADS only. So very excited to try that out. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it. <laughs>